G'day guys, Steve Morgan here for Tackle Junkie Dot Fish and Fishing Monthly Magazines here at the 2016 After Trade Show on the Gold Coast. I'm here with Liam Fitzpatrick from JML Trading and JML are the national distributor of this brand here, Western from Scandinavia and they are bringing out some incredibly lifelike lures with some pretty crazy names into the Australian market Liam and uh, look Pick out a, a few of these guys are pretty interesting, and let's start with that little fella there. What's he all, all about? Right. So this guy is Danny the Duck, new from the Western Stable, fresh to Australia. He is a diving duck, little imitation. Uh, so that's a little floating, oh, like you'd say a bib minnow, but clearly it's not a minnow, it's a, it's a bib duck. <laughs> a bib duck. But, that's uh, a new genre in Australia, yeah, mate. So little rubber <laughs> legs, a little, uh, little bit of movement on the surface, but yeah, so he'll float out there, and obviously you start cranking, we've got a little diving duckling. So. And uh, what, what sort of target fish in Australia are you expecting this, kind of, this thing? Well, instantly you, you start to think Murray Cod, you know, big predators are, are you know, known to eat little aquatic animals off the surface, so Cod's going to be a big factor for those guys. Um, you know, some talk from Barra guys up north that have seen that sort of happen on the dam, so you know, there's a good chance Barra up north, Cod down south, and uh, you know, yep. any other big predators in between. So. Recommended retail for that guy in the store? Uh, so that guy was going for about 25 Yep. Uh, on the shelf. And, now, uh, yeah. hypo-realistic again, we've got uh, this one here. It's a bass, obviously. Barry uh, the bass. Barry the bass. Jointed swim bait and possibly a little bit more of a technical lure than the uh, than the duck. What are these guys coming at? Uh, so that guy is retailing for $36, that one. Yep, and uh, tell so, us about the action of this. This isn't a glide bait per se, it's more of a swim bait yeah, that's got so a natural action. So it's a multi-jointed uh, a swim bait. It's a sinking, a sinking swim bait. So obviously that's going to uh, cast out, start to slowly sink, get it to your, uh, you know, your, your required depth and uh, just a slow retrieve. So you, you've got two toe points, so you can get a different uh, action out of that bottle. And, yep. uh, yeah. Super, and uh, let's pick this fella here. This guy here is the, uh, what's his name? For the bigger brother, we've got Mike the Pike. So another jointed swim bait. Uh, it's a sinking model as well. So hard here, and then soft on the tail and the fins and yeah, all that sort so of stuff. Yeah, little, so little rubber appendages sticking out of those guys. And again, it's got that, that S-shaped swimming action. That's yeah, sort so of like a really a natural, you know, yep. Natural, realistic sort of swim pattern. And, and these, this is the biggest of the baits. What are the retail price? Uh, so we're looking at forty dollars for this guy on the shelf. Yep. Um, now all of these baits aren't in the stores yet, but they're going to be coming in, yeah. in the near future. November. What? We're looking at uh, having November all, these, all the stock levels up for uh, for the Australian market. So you betcha, and of course all of these new products get released at the After Trade Show. We see them filtering out uh, through to around Christmas time and uh, for the summer bite. I know that the Murray Cod guys especially are going to love those big jointed swim baits. It's really trendy at the moment to throw big top waters, big stuff for the, uh, for the Murray Cod. But the saltwater guys, and especially the Barra guys, I reckon are going to be interested in this little fella. What's he called? So that's our Western Hyper Tease Buzz and Blade. So Buzz as in it's got the little, little uh, the buzzer yeah, on the back little... and the blade on the back. So, so to me, looks like a fairly, you know, there's obviously something inside there that stops this thing destroying yeah, so itself it's, when you get a metre barra. Yeah, it's wide through, so you know, you're not going to have a fish swinging off those anyway, but they're wide through, so you're not going to lose your prop and your blade. Uh, it's a tear resistant material, so it's not going to rip and damage easily. And yeah, it's a sinking plastic hybrid, yeah, yeah, yeah. mix of uh, every little concoction Western could come up with. You betcha, it does look like it's been designed by a committee, but on the Barra Tour I fish each year, this uh, this sort of lure, that, that extra stinger hook, the extra bit of flash, ticks a lot of boxes yeah, and uh, um, straight out of the box, uh, how much does one of these fellas cost? Ooh, that guy was 25 I think it was, yeah, 25, 25 bucks re retail. So yeah, so look, if you're looking for something a little bit different to throw at your local fish, be it freshwater or saltwater, keep an eye on these western baits and uh, if you want to find more information, JML's website is jml.net. So and all that information will be up there soon. So Liam, uh, I'm looking forward to seeing on social media some photos of you and these on the water doing some damage. Pretty soon. Keep an eye out, JML.